Hey y'all, welcome back. Jeremy from Shooting News Weekly out here at Copperhead Creek Shooting Club. And I want you to guess what pistol it is that I have in my hand, because this is how I would shoot it. And I'm pretty sure it's smaller than my grip, almost on both sides. That is the Bodyguard 2.0, the brand new version of the Smith & Wesson Bodyguard from Smith & Wesson. It is so dang tiny. It is a skinny, little pocket carry gun in 380 ACP. And there's a couple cool things with the Bodyguard 2.0 versus the original Bodyguard, which we have right here. One, it's a much better looking gun. I mean, it just aesthetically, way, way, way nicer. It also is striker fired with a, with a much improved trigger over the original internal hammer old bodyguard and you can see the slide serrations completely different we've got serrations all over this new guy front and rear where you only had a little bit on the old one and here's the biggest thing capacity in the flush fitting magazine 10 plus one so we have 10 rounds of 380 acp and then in the one with a little pinky extension 12 rounds of 380 acp that is pretty dang good pretty um, puberty uh, for a pocket gun. Very, very impressive. And with the modern 380 ACP ammo, you have a solid self-defense uh, self defense option that fits in a pocket. Decent little trigger, not the best, but for a pocket gun, it's pretty crisp. Little heavier, which is what I would want. Maybe it's six-ish pounds, but you're carrying this guy in like a sticky holster or something right inside of your pocket and it does fit by the way this is the holster from the 1.0 this is the 2.0 maybe it's a little long for it but if you already own a sticky holster you can likely use it with the 2.0 good magazine release good controls good grip texture and oh my god it is so skinny it's amazing that they've managed to keep the gun just as skinny as the old one but now we're fitting 10 rounds in it instead of six let's go ahead Put a few rounds down range. Got 10 loaded up. Thumbs forward, that left thumb, it's gonna get dirty because it's getting a little muzzle blast. Man, oops. Stage the trigger a little on that one. You know what? It's a super sh soft shooter despite how small it is. We aren't straight blowback. We actually have a Browning style, you know, recoil operated mechanism with a delay. Nice. It really very flat and on target. Really impressive with it. I like like the M&P, the full size guys. We're skinny, but we're a little long. Fits really well in the hand. And you know, one interesting thing about the 2.0 here is that my pinky goes on the front strap. This is rare for me for these tiny little guns. Even like my standard size P365, the thumb goes under usually with the flush fitting mag. I am just half on the front. And if I put in the extended one, full pinky right there, men's size, large hands. You know what they say about that. It fits on a bodyguard 2.0. Wow. That triggers so much better than the original. Do some more. Quick reset. So they, much easier to shoot. Smith & Wesson has done a lot to this gun because I've owned this for, I don't know, seven, eight years. This is my pocket gun. It's my normal pocket carry gun. The trigger pull is much, much better. They've gone from this hammer fire to the striker fire. For, it feels like a striker. I don't know if it's a turtle hammer. My guess is a striker. Straight trigger. Uh, straight trigger face, much shorter pull, quick reset, and where the old one had kind of rudimentary sights on it, pretty much useless, this has actual tritium night sights. It's tritium vial on that front with an orange circle around it. Makes it actually usable. Um, and as you can see, Smith & Wesson just made the whole thing look much more M&P-like. 
it looks much more it's much more consistent design wise with the rest of the M&P pistol line uh, so it looks great it actually feels better in the hand um, everything about this is is great I think the MSRP on this is like 449 or something this is a great great little pocket gun um, that's uh, pretty easy to rack 10 plus one rounds in your pocket 12 plus one with the pinky uh, extension and um, that's a huge improvement from Smith. All right, y'all, that is the Smith & Wesson Bodyguard 2.0, a gun that disappears completely in my firing grip and fits very easily in a pocket holster. Bloop, see you later. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe, and we'll see you out here at Copperhead Creek next time.